and we're back folks now here we are We need to search the village, locate the grenade launcher. I'm going to start by trying to get down this slope without causing any issue. There are lots of dead bodies. Okay. There are friendlies here. That's interesting. Why is this place abandoned? Why is that guy in power armor? Hello, bro. Way to freak out. Way to freak out last night. Meaning? We were just sitting around and then you, you barge in piss drunk. You barge right into the village, right into those bloodsuckers. Good thing we were there to put some brakes on you and make sure you sleep it off. And what were you doing here? Hell knows what's going on here. A couple of, of our folks went into the village and never came back. Heck, we didn't even... We were not even keen on dying yet. We're sitting here deciding what to do next. Did you see the bloodsuckers? No. No, our guys were supposed to go to the old water tower, but probably where they went down, well, it made a, we made a deal with the skin flint, go there and check it out, write down the address, will you? We'll write to your family if something goes wrong, seems you'll be, it seems to me you're too kind, okay. Uh, yeah, no, I ain't, I'm not going, like they said bloodsuckers, is there, is there bloodsuckers here? Fantastic. Alright, let's just try and search. There's supposed to be a grade grenade launcher somewhere in this village. So let's just start. And it's it's just giving me a general location. So we just have to search the buildings. It's saying it's in that building up ahead. this building. Gun jam! Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on! What's wrong with this gun? Ah! Oh. Dag nabbit. I died. Okay, I'll see you guys all in a second. Okay, well, that wasn't great. Would have been really useful if my gun hadn't jammed on me. Right, okay. And what is my condition of my gun isn't even that bad. Okay, so we need to get into the, the village. Let's go the same way that we went last time. He's going to tell us the same information, which I'm not interested about, and we need to get to that house. Let's stay in the open. Let's push up. I'm going to have my light on so I can see the glint of their eyes. Where is it? I see it there. Where are they? Come on. Blood suckers. Uh. 
Okay, one down. Let's just get the grenade launcher and leave. Okay, so back in the village. Let's pick up this guy's story. Okay. Yeah, that's the village. Okay, fine. No, I'm not going to take the mission. Okay. So we have the grenade launcher. I'm not overloaded, am I? Oh man, I am. Really? How heavy is this thing? Ah, it's heavy. Okay, fine. I'll drink an energy drink. I need a bit of bread. I was going to go back up there and buy some items, but considering how many... How much, like, how much this gun weighs, I might just go straight back to base. Right, okay. Well, I do, okay, i got to be honest with you, I do know the name of this village, um, because it carries the, the delightful name of Bloodsucker Village. Um, like, in the guide and stuff, I have seen pictures, it's called Bloodsucker Village, and for good reason. So, yeah. As you can imagine, not good. Um, so let's... Do need a bit of money. I know this is heavy, but I I need to sell some stuff. I'm gonna drop the pistol if I don't really need it. I thought there was a third body around here. Yeah. Uh, take the pistol. That's probably too much for me to carry. Yeah. Curses. I need to drop something. Well, I'm going to come back through this way anyway. Um, so let's... So let's drop that ammunition. I'll also drop a couple of the basic healing packs. Okay. Right. Let's just get back to base and drop off the, um... Drop off the, the grenade launcher, because it's super heavy. Does it at least look cool? Yeah, it looks really cool. Not that I can use it. Okay. As usual, folks, I'm going to put a... Qu I know, like, these... F they, they, you will, I have to... This for so sorry. I am a bit, uh... Out of sorts today. Um, yes. Um, the blood suckers rattled me a bit. I'm going to put a quick cut in. As always, it just involves. I know it's a bit annoying, but it's just how it is. I'll see you all guys in a minute. And we're back. Right. Right. Wait, what? what? What's this? The game is telling me that I've got some kind of marker. Yeah. Take the bulldog from the stas in the village. Yeah, I've done that. Like, task. Yeah, bring... Oh, that's what it's... Okay, I understand that. Basically, the game is telling me, oh, you need to go and get the gun, like the gun from the village, but I picked it up from somewhere else. 
So the game is a bit confused. Okay. The world fears the zone's expansion. Join duty and save the innocent. Okay. I'd just be happy to get rid of this. This thing's really heavy. And this... No, I've got plenty of endurance stuff on. And there we go. Hello, brother. Why have you come? Here's the Bulldog 6. Good work, Stalker. This is actually what we needed. Well marked one. You carried out my request, now in turn I take... Uh, you can take the suit, I think you'll, you'll like it. You need to do anything for me. Grill the pack of dogs, find the enhanced rifle, and neutralize the bandit. Okay, that's good to know. Um... I can't move because I'm encumbered, because of course I am. Ah. PS79MMD. Universe Protection. A wonderful protection suit for the zone. Stalkers appreciate it because it's combined excellent bulletproof, excellent bulletproof, and bullet, so excellent anomaly proof and bulletproof qualities. It includes, it includes in the, PA, the PS79D suit, a closed circuit breathing system and an integrated system of anomaly field suppressant provides quality bullet bullet and splint protection. I wonder if it's got first or second generation um first or second generation um rad uh, night vision. Because that's something I really like to have. Okay. I just need to sell a little bit just so I have enough movement on me to, to sort of get going. Can I still move? No. And that is annoying. Gonna have to sell a couple of med kits. And he won't buy anything that's actually that heavy. Yeah, that's annoying. Um yeah, just gonna have to. I've got some mech stored away, so it's not a massive issue. Just eat a little bit. What are you, Dave? What are you here? Yeah, yeah, fine, mate. I heard you. Right, so what's this? Yeah, I've brought the bulldog to the general. I hope this isn't one of those bugs where it's going to say, oh, your mission is not finished. And it's like, hmm. Yeah, it's, it's done that again. Which is annoying, because it means that these markers are going to be on the map for ages now. Right. Chernobyl veterans, join duty. We have a huge responsibility to protect the world from annoying. the expanding zone. Right. Free stalkers, veterans and I want to see if this stash duty. here is... Protecting the world is, from the zone's evil is our common goal. Yeah, it's bugged as well. That's annoying. I wish some of the stasses in this game weren't bugged, just so they would get off the map. Right, so what's... what out of this? But suit is better. That's... Chernobyl veterans, join duty. We have a huge responsibility to protect the world from the expanding zone. Okay, so that's better radiation protection. That's better chemical burns. I wish you could just compare. It would be much easier. So that's better. Attention, stalkers. We 
Okay, so this one is overall better in some areas in comparison to others. Okay. Good to know. I just need to get to the. I just need to get to um the bar. Right. I said, come in. Don't stand there. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I've always got something interesting for people like you. My information might well be of use to you, Stalker. Get that done. Take these, please. I can unload that. Okay. I got enough ammo, I don't need a ton of ammo. Right, so. Man, that was a bad rake. Let's trade that. Come here. I've always got something interesting for people like you. My information might well be of Unload this you. ammunition. I'm going to pick up my... I guess that's fate. Don't tell me I left my scope weapon somewhere else. Oh, I left it in the, um... Come here. I left it in my other stash. But then again, I don't need to have one that uses the same ammunition type. Okay. Um Piss off. My information might well be of use to you, Stalker. Its condition is getting pretty low now, unfortunately, for that. I'll take it as a backup weapon. Come here. I've always got something interesting for people like you. And I'll take some... Some additional ammunition. My information might well be of right. use to you, Stalker. It's a shame that I can't put this on. I don't think I can put this on this gun. Come here. No. I've always got something interesting for people like you. Okay. I'm going to drop the grenades for now because I just continually forget to use them. I know I should probably use them. Right. Okay. This is my plan. I've been meaning to do this for a while now. We need to go and talk to the doctor. That involves, unfortunately... This gun is just getting run down. It's a shame that you can't repair guns in, um... It's a shame that you can't repair guns in Shadow of Chernobyl. You can in the later games. In this game, you just have to let them sort of break, which is unfortunate, because that gun is really expensive. Um... Get out of here, stalker. Well, to be fair, so is this gun. I'm... I'm... No when they're replacing it if it breaks. They charge so much. Do you have the dog extermination? Yeah, purge dog, yeah, I'm up for it. Okay. This is just a straightforward job. It gets me a little bit of money. And I have to kill them, these guys anyway. Quickly just go back, turn that in, get a bit more cash. Plus, it ha keeps duty happy. Get a 
meat chunk artifact. There we go. Can basically then turn it in and get a bit of extra pay. Easy way of getting the meat chunk artifact. Right. Got to run. We do have to go to the one place that I hate going, which is the labs. Really, these guys are still here. Man, that was a. That took 10 rounds to kill that thing. Mustn't have hit it well enough in the head. Right. Inventory. Okay, inventory wise. We're about to go through the loading area. Um, as always, folks, I like. As we're going through the garbage, I will cut out the garbage just so that you guys. What was that? To limit the camp. Oh, I took care of the camp. I just didn't go back for the reward. Um, I'll cut out the garbage just because we've been through there so much. I also see you when we get to the labs. And we're back, folks. We have got a quick mission popped up. Help the stalkers fight off the bandits in the plant. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard. Nothing really happened going through the garbage. Had to clear out some more bandits as usual. But that's about it. Just had to keep an eye out for bloodsuckers, as always. I have to help them help hold off bandits. That's unfortunate, we lost a stalker. Чего заскучали, мужики? Так, убери оружие. Так, убери оружие. Just another bandit raid. Supposed to be helping guard the um. Сначала оружие убери, тогда и разговор. Okay. Оружие убрал. Right. Supposed to help them. Guard this place. Оружие убрал.
really, dude. Okay. Good for you. Right. That was to liquidate the camp. Yeah. To turn it in and get rewarded for that. I now have to do the the really unpleasant bit of this, which I not want. Which I haven't wanted to do for for a while. Like if we want to go and see the doctor, which we want to go and do, um, we need to go down into the sewers again. And I do not like doing that. I shall see you guys in a second. And we're back, folks. And we're here, looking for the enemy. Um, we're looking for the doctor. He's in, he's in his old hideout, which is not great for us. This place is full, unfortunately, of... Is full, unfortunately, of... Um, of bandits and bloodsuckers, which is not something I really want to deal with. Bloke up ahead. All this night vision is. All this light is killing my night vision. Yeah, he had a nice shotgun. Only I had shotgun sound cells. Right. Beard overweight. He had an upgraded. Ooh, that is okay. I'm going to say that right now. This is actually. I'm going to pick up these guns. That was something down here with me. Is terrifying. If push comes to stuff, I can just use this as a backup weapon. But we need to get to the safe house. I hate coming to this place. Pretty sure there's a bloodsucker in here as well. If it's respawned. Bloodsucker. I think I got some hits on it. If 
post comes stuff, I just shoot it at full pace and just spl split it wide open. Where is it? Quickly. Oh, that was nasty, and I walked into acid, which absolutely annihilated my um, suit. Yeah, not as bad as I thought it was. But still, my suit took a bit of a hit. Now, I need to find the doctor. I hate bloodsuckers. Let's get in here. And get up here. What the? Hey, Strela. Strela, come on, man, wake up. Oh, this better. You had me worried. What the hell are you doing, man? Have you lost your memory or something? You were the one who suggested that we take this precaution. Oh well, at least you're... at least you're still alive. Look, Strela, we've got no time, so I need you to listen to me. Everything you have said about the monolith is true. All of it. It is just an illusion manufactured in a lab next to the sarcophagus. Nobody, nobody who reached the monolith has ever come back. It looks like they have died there. But anyway, while you are away, I dug up some more info. And basically, there is a decoder to open the door which leads to the monolith controls. And this decoder is hidden in a stash and prepping. I'm going to give you the coordinates of this stash, and I'm giving you the key to open it. I want you to take the decoder, and I want you to find the door in the sarcophagus. And then you... well, you'll know what to do. But it seems that this is the only way of uncovering the zone's real secret. This is the one you have been trying to work out, Strela. And we're back in here. And apparently, apparently we know, we now know the secret. Apparently, we are Strelik. Diary. Personal notes. Okay. You'd think they'd have a meeting with a doctor here. Right. Um, go to the hotel, find the room with the secret stash, look for the secret stash. So we are Strelik, apparently. Um, the game has informed us that yes, we are in fact Strelik. We've had just retrograde amnesia from our trauma of pretty much almost dying. Um, so yes, yes indeed, and that was unpleasant. Now, we need to get out. And as always, we have a couple of ways. We can go back to where we came. Or we can go through the Institute. But I'm going to go back to where we came. And just pray that the... Um, that the creatures haven't respawned. Let's just go. Of course, we're over encumbered now. Let's just get up the stairs. I have.
have to say, I, I love Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl for its bugs and its age. This game has such a feel to it that you just don't find in modern suits anymore. Even these games like Metro and stuff like, I like Metro, but the thing is, it's a very linear game, Metro. Um, they added an open world one in the third game, um, a more open world nature to it, but even then. Um, but yes. I'm going to put another cut in here, folks, and we'll see each other next time. I think this is a good point to bring it to the end. We have found out that we are, in fact, Strelik himself with amnesia, and um, Monolith isn't real. Well, the Monolith isn't real. It's some kind of device, some kind of trick to lure people in. We picked up some interesting guns. A shotgun, a unique shotgun. Um, we can use slugs, which are nice. Or we could uh, have this with grenade launch attachment, which is also very nice. Um, tempted to sell them, to be honest, to get a bit more of extra money. But our current objectives are, well, we can't kill Strelik, because we are Strelik. Um, find Strelik. Well, I thought this would disappear by now. Um, right, we've eliminated the bandits. Go back for our ward. Oh man, that's going to be such a pain. Yeah, that one. Yeah, we have to do take care of that one then. Um, and the bandit one will take care of I just probably have to do some running around, really. It's just a bit time-consuming, but it's likely what we'll have to do. Then we have to get over to... to there. And f get to the hotel, find the room with the secret stash, unlock the stash. Okay. And that's turn off the brain scourer. Okay. What's this? Find that. Oh, and that's... Oh, that's a prairie at itself. Okay, yeah. That's going to be interesting. But that's a whole host of things that we need to get done, but that's for next time, folks. I've been Cornish Knight. This has been Stalker Saddle of Chernobyl. I'll see you all again next time. Goodbye.